This video will help you quickly assemble your Eureka Brush Roll Clean with Suction Seal Vacuum in just a few steps and without tools, so you can get up and running in minutes. First, unpack the vacuum and identify all of the parts. You'll find the vacuum base, backbone and hose, handle and turbo nozzle, extension wand and crevice tool, dusting brush, and dust cup. Begin assembly by aligning the backbone with the base and pushing it down, snapping it into place. You should hear it snap when assembled correctly. Be sure to gently pull up on the backbone to ensure that it is solidly attached. Next, place the handle on top of the backbone and firmly snap it into place. Again, gently pull up on the handle to ensure a tight fit. Your vacuum may come with the hose already attached which means you will not need to complete the following step. To attach the hose, locate the hose connector and align the tabs with the tabs on the vacuum. Press the pieces together and rotate clockwise to secure. With the hose attached, wind it through the hose retainer. Place the end in the designated hook. Then press the hose into the retainer clips on the side of the vacuum. Place the dust cup onto the vacuum by setting the bottom of the dust cup on the circular rest on the vacuum base. Then push the dust cup toward the backbone to lock it into place. Gently pull on the dust cup to confirm that it has securely latched. Your crevice tool will likely come nested inside the extension wand. If it does not, place the crevice tool inside the extension wand and attach both to the side of the vacuum in the storage clips. Next. Place the dusting brush on the back of the vacuum. The turbo nozzle should already be attached to the handle. If not, clip the turbo nozzle into the holder on the back of the vacuum handle. Your new Eureka Brush Roll Clean with Suction Seal Vacuum is now assembled and ready to use. This vacuum features an automatic cord rewind and the cord is stored in the vacuum. To unwind the cord, simply pull the cord to the desired length for convenient cleaning. To prepare your vacuum for cleaning floors, turn the airflow control switch to floor. To recline the vacuum, step on the gray handle release pedal near the base of the vacuum and pull back on the handle. Lightly press the red power switch to turn the vacuum on. To turn it off, press the pedal again. The vacuum has a carpet height adjustment, which is used to clean various types of carpet. Begin vacuuming with the height adjustment at the highest carpet position and then lower it to adjust the height for your carpet. The vacuum should move easily across your floors. The vacuum comes with an on-off brush roll switch for safe, scatterproof, multi-surface cleaning. To clean bare floors, set the carpet height adjustment to bare floors and turn off the brush roll using the gray pedal located on the left side of the base. Press the pedal again to turn the brush roll back on for deep carpet cleaning. To clean the brush roll with Brush Roll Clean technology, first ensure that the vacuum and brush roll are turned on. Press the Brush Roll Clean pedal for approximately 10 seconds. The loud noise will let you know that the brush roll is being cleaned. To clean using the hose and accessories, keep the unit in the upright locked position and turn the airflow control switch to tools. Attach the desired tool to the end of the wand. When you are finished vacuuming, turn the vacuum off and press the button on the back of the vacuum to retract and store the cord. If you have additional questions about assembling your new Eureka Brush Roll Clean with Suction Seal Vacuum, please refer to our website, eureka.com, where you can locate the owner's manual and other helpful resources. For any issues, contact our customer service helpline at 1-800-282-2886. We hope you enjoy your new Eureka vacuum cleaner.